So up to now, we are not really satisfied with the way things are taking place in the council. Uh, there are a few uh, uh, members that really are concerned about the lifting of the sanctions. And I would say probably the majority of the council members are concerned about the continuation of the sanctions and the suffering of the Iraqi people. But the American and the British pressure continues on those members to try not to address that issue in any significant way. Huh? Oh, you were. <laughs> so what should I do? You were talking. Uh, with the fact that has been established now that civilian targets were hit, residential areas were hit, hospitals and so forth, uh, there was a great uh, damage both physically and psychologically to the people of Iraq. We want a clean process, which Anuscom was not serving, and Anuscom was not demonstrating. Uh, again, I stress our position uh, in Iraq that it's not personal. The issue here is the overall work of Anuscom that has been uh, uh, biased, that has been motivated politically by the U.S. policy. And unless this is changed, uh, there is no way in dealing with any uh, chairman of Anuscom. Can we just ask you one or two quick questions? Would that be possible? Just, just one question. How about one, one question? Сейчас идет обсуждение в Совете Безопасности новой ситуации, которая сложилась вокруг Ирака, в том, что касается политического регулирования. Естественно, сейчас все члены Совета Безопасности, и Россия, и Китай, и Соединенные Штаты, и Великобритания, и все другие, обсуждают конкретные вопросы, которые необходимо, конкретные шаги, которые необходимо предпринять для продолжения процесса урегулирования в соответствии с резолюциями Совета Безопасности, которые имеются. Как вы знаете, выполнение соответствующих резолюций предполагает снятие санкций. Так что это все те вопросы, которые сегодня обсуждаются. Решений пока нет. Все. Pleasure to be here this morning. Um, uh, insurmountable uh, uh, barriers for. With respect to Saddam's arsenal of deadly weapons, our strategy will be simple. If he rebuilds it, we will come. We have the obligation to do this, we have the will to do this, and we have the forces in the region that are ready to do it to destroy its weapons and account for its weapons of mass.